patients have different needs and some patients have uh, the need for a lot of different teams to be working on their care at the same time. So what we're keen to do is highlight those patients as early as possible in their stay so we can coordinate the care more effectively. We've known for a long time that there's variation in the time of day that patients arrive and in the volumes that patients arrive. But it turns out that we can begin to predict this with more reliability than we previously thought. We're starting to be able to build a better common language so that people can communicate more effectively about what the problems are. Sometimes we believe very strongly that it's a certain type of problem and the data tells us it's not. And sometimes we really weren't sure before and now we've got better insight into where, uh, where the problems might be occurring. The team that worked on the project was largely clinically led, so we've worked very closely with the senior doctors, nurses and allied health professionals who work in the system. And then we have a set of information technicians who've worked very hard to begin to get the data out in a different way. And then finally we've put one or two new teams together to begin developing new business processes. With a relatively small team of staff, we managed to bring together three different types of capability. The first is the ability to automate data flows so that we don't need to consistently go looking for data, but we have it moving in the way that we want it to move. Secondly, we did the calculations on it that would enable us, first of all, to better predict what's happening, but also connect different data systems together. And thirdly, we've been able to build something that can visualise that quite intuitively to help people make better decisions in a more timely way. We feel like we're at the beginning of a journey, and that even though this particular infrastructure has enabled us to see some things in a new way, we're really learning about the other things that we need to know to begin developing the system more effectively. Where we're going to next with this is that whilst the hub centralises and visualises the data in a new way. We now want to take that out to every department so that we can connect the hospital and the community-based health services together. 